Hello, I'm Brad from the Arcade, and today I'm going to be doing another tech tutorial. This one is just showing you all the types of generators um, and how useful they can be in what in what order they are useful. So these are in order, but I'll go over that more in a second. <coughs> Excuse me. So this is just a basic generator. You just put your fuel in there, like coal, charcoal, pretty much anything made of wood. You know, just general things like that. And then you can hook that up with copper cables to your machinery and that will power them but these ones don't rely on coal these rely on other things uh, they're all different and they're more independent um, I think that's probably the best way to describe it so the first thing we have is a windmill and to craft that you need an ironinger in each of these corner pieces and then a generator uh, a generator is crafted by one RE battery at the top a machine block in the middle and the furnace there machine blocks made by refined iron but or you could have an iron furnace three refined iron and an RE battery at the top and that would do the same thing and that's a windmill now windmills uh, they do need to be placed uh, quite high for them to work I think it's uh, oh, excuse me, I'm just gonna fly. Um, I think it is about 95 blocks minimum they need to be placed uh, for them to be like worth it inverted commas um, but this is a hundred and six and I'll just link that up with the glass fiber cables to my back box and it's going up uh, fairly quickly um, it's not that fast but still um, it is just running off wind so we'll give it that uh, the next thing is a water mill uh, water mills you can either put a bucket of water in the bottom to power them there or you can surround them in water like I've done here. So the water mill, then you have copper cables going to a bat box, and that just goes up quite slowly. So let's have a look at you craft that. It is four pieces of wooden planks in like a cross with a generator in the middle, and then sticks in the corner pieces, and you get two water mills. Um, I, I said I was doing this in order, but you can see that the windmill at the moment is producing more power than the water mill well that is because I put this one first because this is very unreliable and it changes according to the weather like it, it performs better in the rain and you have to be really lucky to get it to work as well as I've got it to work so I'm quite lucky but still they are both pretty bad water mills and windmills so if I was you I would recommend this one which is the solar panels so I'm just going to quickly show you how to craft that that is three coal dust, you get that from macerating coal or macerating coal or if you have a silk touch on your pickaxe a silk touch enchantment that's uh, three pieces of glass an electronic circuit and a generator so an electronic circuit is made with a piece of refined iron two redstone, three copper cables um, they have to be insulated copper cables and that's how you make a solar panel so then you can just stick them all along here if I just get rid of that you can see this um glass fiber cables and I think that I think that actually does require a diamond oh you can't get it like that. Um glass fiber cables I don't know if I will be able to find it on here. I can't use TMI because I'm in uh minimize screen so let's see if we can find it. There it is. Okay recipe yeah it requires one diamond redstone and glass and you get four so it's quite expensive but if you've uh, it's quite easy to get diamonds on tech it to be honest and if you can't find them you can just transmute them so but then you just link that all up to a bat box and that powers it very quickly so I'll just show you how quickly that goes up <laughs> that that is a lot so it got to a thousand in just a few seconds um, the next one is a geothermal generator and that needs uh, two empty cells, a generator, refined iron and a glass. Uh, an empty cell is made from four tin like this or another type of tin. That's strange. Uh, I think um, I haven't seen the other type of tin, I've only seen the one, but you can do it with both types of tin. <laughs> um, and this is over here. Now I'm not going to show you the last one, which is a nuclear reactor, <laughs> because these are 
quite complicated to be honest and they produce insane amounts of power so I'm going to save that for a whole video of their own so that will probably be the next tech tutorial so the last one now is the geothermal generator so you have some lava here hence the geothermal uh, geo means like world like geography and thermal means heat as in thermal decomposition <laughs> so here we go you just get a normal pump and you put it over some lava and then this little thing will come down out of the pump so it all comes from the same block then you get some redstone engines here and then you get a lever or a redstone torch and you power those then these will power the pump which will carry the lava up here up through the wooden waterproof pipe through the cobblestone waterproof pipes to tanks and tanks are crafted by grass, but glass, sorry, shaped like a furnace in a square. And then you can have another redstone engine which comes to another water, a waterproof wooden pipe to more waterproof cobblestone pipes. Then these need to go underneath, they need to come from the underneath of the geothermal generator. And then we should get our power. So this is full already. Now just look how quickly this goes up. This is insane. This is absolutely mental. So <laughs> each tank can hold 16 buckets of water, fuel, lava, etc. I think this can hold 24 buckets. And that's just about it really. And then that all goes to the bat box. But if you want to use something that can store more, then you could probably use an MFE or an MFSU but I don't really recommend that, I'd recommend an MFE but it's up to you, you can use either one they still do the same job at the end, of, still do the same job at the end of the day so yeah that's been it uh, for this tech tutorial, please like and favourite if you did like the, in, like the video, if you didn't like the video then don't like it <laughs> and I'll see you next episode when we should be building a nuclear reactor so goodbye